it's a very smooth dynamic um, to a point where I feel that we almost can't get a writer's block because even though we don't have an idea, we always just put something on loop, you know what I mean? Um, like the moment we start working, uh, I don't even think there was even a pause between the moment we stop. I mean, the moment we start and the moment we, we finish. It's just like a whole, it's all in one motion almost. And, uh, or like sometimes we do a, uh, the whole structure of a song, like without the bridge and everything or, or whatever, and just stop there. Because like all that's left is to tweak it. So we'll just stop there and then move to the next one. Stop there, move to the next one. We think we sort of stop each other from, um, you know, getting too caught up in the, yeah. in the intricacies of it, you know what I mean? And just, Keep it on a very like yeah out of the whole vibe like yeah keep it on more be... of a vibe level rather than a rather than a um, technical level you know what I mean it's just yeah it's all in the in the, in the whole jam session of yeah it. it's more like a jam rather than rather than you know two electronic producers yeah very like hmm change it that to that to that this will blah 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 no it's more so like... Be like for the most part it will be um. You know the way we did it. We had a couple of keyboards set up and stuff, and it was like, you know, we come up with a loop in, you know, five ten minutes or whatever, and then just keep the loop running all the time, yeah. and then yeah. we're like continually, you know, adding or taking away or uh, you making little arrangement changes while it's playing while the whole thing's running, so yeah. you never lose the sort of. It's like this. You never lose the train of it. It just keeps. Yeah. Exactly. Like it's it's a whole. And then before you session. realize it, it's done. It's uh, well. First of all, it's, it's, to to me or probably to him too, it's, it's it's a rap record, right? Like it's just straight like rap bangers that rappers can totally get on. There's there's space for a rapper kind of thing, and it's basically like what what we're intending to do with this tonight project is just to go straight into mainstream rap music in the states and go against all the top producers in there right now. So, but not only that, like I also feel like this whole project is. Uh, is sort of a voice for all our homies, you know what I mean? Like, not only Lucky Me, but like, Night Slugs Crew and all them dudes, you know what I mean? Like, just like, all the homies of our scene put together and this is what we're presenting to the Americans or something like that, you know what I mean? Like, um, because like, for, like, he, he was saying, it's, I don't know, like a lot of people in like major labels and stuff, they, they know we're around. They're very well aware of us but don't even bother trying to contact us. They just straight freaking rob us almost. I wouldn't say rob, just like get the idea. You know what I mean? Like get the idea and get another producer to do it. And um, for a while we were like, whatever. We got our own little scene going. I don't mind, it's all good. But now after that we are like, okay, okay, hold up. <laughs> it's getting a little too obvious. From us growing up in our, in our little circle or sphere of music. Yeah. Um, you know, you sort of had a, a inkling for a while that maybe you know uh, more commercial mainstream producers were sort of vaguely pinching ideas or like you know sort of boring, but you never really be certain about it. And yeah. it was sort of like you know, I definitely had the 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 distinction in my head of like we're we're all doing this type of stuff. Those guys are in like huge studios doing you know like massive budget huge studios all working on the best equipment the best whatever you know what i mean whereas the reality of it is like all those guys are doing the exact same thing that we're doing is sitting on a laptop with fruity loops like all you know it's just it just happens to be like in a different sort of sphere of music yeah. but it's basically the same thing and, and then sort of come to the realization that like actually a lot of those guys are aware of of us and what what we've been doing and are like you know what i mean like you just you thought it was a completely different world but but in reality of it people are well aware and they're just like either just borrowing a little bit and not saying anything or just um borrowing a lot <laughs> <laughs> borrowing a lot yeah on my uh, first full length album and uh, that's for like I'm planning to release it by the end of the year 
And after that, after I'm done with that album, I'll be working on an EP. Uh, well, the album's forth forthcoming on Looking Me. And afterwards, like next year, probably early next year, I'll be starting to work on uh, an EP for Mad Decent. Um, five, six track EP, maybe. But I still out in the open. Um, but yeah, uh, on, on my album, I'm also trying to like, it's also my goal to this year to really like reach out to rappers, reach out to vocalists. You know, I'm really trying to build a, a list of like singers that I can always hit up and they're always down to work. Or rappers, so I can always hit up or down to work. That kind of stuff, I'm trying to like build it up right now. So, um, the t I feel like the Tonight Project will really help bring our, our work to the, those rappers and vocalists. To make them see like, all right, these guys are legit. They, they're not fucking around. <laughs> well, I mean, this is, the Tonight stuff's gonna be our focus for like the next yeah. month or two or something yeah, like that um and we've got like a lot of festival shows for that coming up and then um i've got a load of my own festival dates over the summer and then i've got another album which is nearing being finished but i'm taking my time with it you know what i mean i'm not trying to rush it out it's been like i think like two two and a bit years since the last one so it's like i'm not in a sort of I'm not in a in a rush with it, you know what I mean? I'd like to have out by sort of end of the year, early next year, that's the sort of rough plan. But um I'm not sort of forcing it, you know what I mean? And and for the moment this project is like this is a focus for for the next little while and, and um as Linus is saying, like working with, with more vocalists, working with more MCs. Yeah. Very doing really. more doing more sessions with you know, um different different MCs different like I feel like that sort of movement is backed with all of our homies together kind of thing being like this is us you can't do this shit you can't just take our ideas and come up with all that after all these years we're coming for you <laughs>